Pilsners, lagers, and stouts, oh my. Dozens of beer lovers gathered to the riverfront to try a sip from Stateline Brewers at the 8th Annual Screw City Brewfest. Mariana Rodriguez was there, and Mariana, enthusiasts didn't just have beer to enjoy. That's right, Brittany. Thousands showed up for the annual Screw City Beer Fest, right in the heart of downtown Rockford. And this year's new location wasn't the only thing that was flowing. It's a taste testing gone wild. It's a, it's a great reason to come to Rockford. Food, music, and of course, beer. The annual Screw City Beer Festival attracted crowds of people to downtown Rockford, and this year's new location by the Rock River was a hit. I like the change this year. I think it's more spread out, and I think it just... Um, just kind of gives more of an area so you're not as, you know, it's more spread out. Craft beer enthusiasts had over 50 different breweries to try from, each worked by people who know their craft well. This festival is different than most of the rest because we require uh, breweries to actually have representatives here. So every brewery is represented by either the owner, the head brewer, or somebody that's highly involved in the operations. Daniel Saltis traveled all the way from Iowa to attend this year's beer fest. He's born and raised in Rockford and says if he had to choose, he prefers a small town feel. Do you have more opportunity to try like your favorite beers here as opposed to like a big city uh, brewery festival? Craft beer enthusiast Adam Morrison said he first found out about the festival through Facebook and hasn't missed the fest since. It's always fun too to do it with your, you know, you come with a group of people and see friends that you haven't seen maybe in a while and I don't know it's just it's a really nice event. He adds that events like this help put Rockford in a positive spotlight. I think it's just great for Rockford in general I mean everyone's for some reason has a bad opinion about Rockford for the most part and then there's stuff like this and it's like hey this is a great place to live. I mean it's awesome. Festival organizers also told me this year's 2300 general admission tickets sold out in just 20 minutes. Brittany? Thanks for that Mariana.